Obituaries are sponsored by Colonial Funeral Home and Stokes Chapel, Fair, Ray, and Perry Spencer Funeral Homes, Boone and Cook Funeral Home and Crematory. Three announcements from Fair Funeral Home. Graveside services for Ruby Silver's Harbor 87 are today at 11 at Ridgeview Memorial Gardens, with visitation one hour prior. She was born in Burnsville, retired from Miller Brewing as a supervisor of the cafeteria, and attended King's Memorial Church in Eden. Surviving are sons Norman, Eddie, Harbor, and Ramona, Tim, Harbor, and Kim, five grandchildren, three great-grandchildren, sisters June Laws and Sam, Shirley Dockery and Eddie, Helen Robertson and Sherman, and Lola Radford. Funeral services for Jeffrey Melvin Fane are today at 2 with visitation one hour prior. A celebration of life service for Laura Horton Watts, 58, formerly of Lancaster, South Carolina, is today at 3 at Tabernacle United Methodist Church, Rev. Larry King officiating with burial in the church cemetery. The family requests masks be worn and practice uh, be worn and practice social distancing. Visitation in the fellowship hall one hour prior to the service. Surviving are son Nolan Ryan Watts and wife Cameron of Matthews, daughter Amanda Lauren Watts of Charleston, brother Myron Horton and wife Debbie of Eden, and two grandchildren. Memorials may be made to the American Cancer Society or to her church. Two announcements from Boone and Cook Funeral Home. Funeral services for Janice Diane Sands, 72, of Ridgeway, are tomorrow at 2, followed by a small graveside service at Ridgeview Memorial Gardens. The family will receive friends at 1 and other times at the residence. She was born in Greensboro and was self-employed. She was preceded in death by husband James Jim Walter Sands. Surviving are children... Angela Hopp and Willie, Edward Bolin and Bobby, and Otis Bolin. Siblings, Terry Martin and Forrest, and Bobby Hart and Lori. Eight grandchildren and seven great-grandchildren. Memorial contributions may be made to the Alzheimer's Association. Ricky Durham, 63, of Stoneville, died this morning. Arrangements are incomplete. Two announcements from Perry Spencer Funeral Homes. Public viewing for Nadine Bell Highland, 66, of Greensboro, is tomorrow, 1 to 7.30 in Madison, with funeral services Wednesday at 1. Arrangements for Tony C. Brown, 66, of Madison, are incomplete in Madison.